Central High School. Today's date is Tuesday, June 5th, 2018. Welcome to Everything Sports and Panther News. I'm Jenna Lucio and I'm here with Sadie Budzik, replacing Carter because he just didn't show up today. He's probably at the uh, honors or the student of the month breakfast, maybe. Yeah. Um, neither of us were picked for that. A little salty about that. Missy Fuel, you got me next year. <laughs> um, We've got some special guests in the back today running our board. We've got Tyler Baldwin. He's wearing a red graduation cap. Um, he's not graduating, so that's weird. But anyway, Sadie, what are we having for lunch today? For lunch today, we're having a soft chicken taco with cheese, lettuce and tomato, salsa, garden salad, steam court, and a tropical fruit mix. Oh, tropical. All right, we like that. OK, so now for the news. There will be a mandatory meeting for the, all those interested in taking AP literature today, June 5th, at 2.30 in room 719, Mrs. Lyons' See Mrs. Lyons with any questions. There will be a mandatory meeting for all those interested in taking AP government and politics next school year on Wednesday, June 6th, so, so that's tomorrow, at 2.30 in room 714, Mr. Borton's room. This meeting is regarding summer work and is mandatory. See Mr. Borton with any questions. Any students wanting to take, take AP Studio Art next year must attend a mandatory meeting on Thursday, June 7th at 2.30 in room 605. Summer artwork will be assigned and questions will be answered. Please see Mr. Fisk with, if you have a conflict with this meeting. And attention all freshmen. We are in need of volunteers for the Travelers Championship on June 19th. Please see Hunter Boyce or Mr. Chapins with questions or to sign up. You will earn community service hours and money for the class of 2021. And now we have a quick little uh, announcement. So last week we got a chance to visit with the alumni Ryan Christopher at Channel 8 News on a CT style set. Here's a short clip of what we did there. I'd like to welcome some awesome guests right here from so Connecticut. Some packed house. There Let's you go. Hey. Now you have ties to Cromwell High School. This is the Cromwell High School video production news production crew. So I think they're going to be taking over our job someday. Soon. Now, do they have that around when you were in high school? They did, yes. And I still have some DVDs at home of. Please bring them to us. I don't know if we want to <laughs> I watch would love that. to see them. Oh no, 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 no! You don't want to see me in high school. It was a sad thought. But shout out to Cromwell High School, <laughs> Coach Pap. Uh, anybody who there is, is watching. So we're excited to have them here today and also our good friend Courtney Huggins is yes. here. Yeah, so we all look really awkward there, so just ignore that. Anyway, coming up this week, we have a sneak peek at more alumni and what they're up to now. And now to your weather forecast with Lev, the temporary weather guy. Lev, what's going on out there? Uh, today, Tuesday, June 5th, maybe, think so. Uh, we have a high of 71 and low 52 with afternoon showers. And on Wednesday, we have mostly cloudy with a high of 69 and a low of 52. And on Thursday, we have a high of 71 and a low of 58, partly cloudy. And now for the sports. There's a mandatory cross-country meeting today in room 602 right after school. Lovely. Thank you, Sadie. And Lev, of course, thank you for joining us today. Yep. Yep. All right, please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance in a moment of silence. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Have a great day, CHS, and tune in tomorrow for our next episode of Everything Sports and Panther News.